Hello, my fellow silica enthusiasts, and welcome to another tutorial about silica 2. Today, we're going to look at how to claim rewards from Cilium to instant unstake your stake and how to transact on the proto mainnet. First of all, you need to have your Silpay wallet ready, and we're going to switch from mainnet to the proto mainnet again. You switch to private and you change the API URL to the following. Copy it quickly. api.cq2-protomainnet.silica.com Make sure that you remove the slash at the end of it if you copy it from somewhere, otherwise you're going to run into problems. You see I already prepared here a wallet and I have some sills on protomainnet on it. If you don't have any, you can simply go to def.silica.com slash silica2 slash endpoints and then scroll to the very bottom. You paste your wallet address to the faucet. You click request and in no time you should receive your sales on your wallet. You can refresh. We see it updated. As a next step, we go to the Cillian staking portal on Proto Mainnet, which is cillian.silstg.dev. I'm already here on the dashboard page. Let me quickly get back. You see on the top right hand side that you are on the Proto Mainnet version of Cillian when it is stated here as CQ2 Proto Mainnet. Then we do the usual process as you would do with staking on the old Cillian page. We sign in for delegators, we sign in with Silpay, and we have to unlock our wallet. It's now retrieving the wallet information while I quickly unlock my hardware device. And select the Silica app. You see here uh, the testing wallet that I prepared has a uh, quite rather large um, deposit and it has some rewards accumulated. First thing we do is we have to claim our rewards. If you run into a problem, you always make sure that you increase the gas limit. I just pick something random. We confirm on the wallet. I confirm on my hardware wallet and I sign the transaction. You should now also see the speed of the Silica Proto Mainnet because the transaction should confirm very quickly. You see, transaction went through, it was a success. You can refresh and we see that everything went well. If we go back to the page, we click on done and we refresh it very quickly. You can also see that the rewards have arrived on our wallet. By refreshing the wallet, you see the funds are ready. Now the rewards have been claimed and we want to instant unstake our deposit. Here the 20 million, we click manage. We click initiate stake withdrawal. Uh, again, I will increase the gas limit. You may need to play around a little bit with that, but this way it always worked. Confirm the transaction and I also sign the transaction in my hardware wallet. I will give it a couple of seconds to confirm. We can look again at the transaction. We see it went through. Success. Let's quickly refresh it so we can see it again. Okay, confirmed. Successful. Now we wait again for the UI to fetch the information that was very quick. So you, if you started or initiated the stake withdrawal, you now see the instant withdrawal because um, we removed the bounding period that is usually uh, 14 days. So here we now complete the stake withdrawal by clicking here and we see withdraw, confirm on the wallet, and I sign again on hardware wallet and we wait another second.
let's look at the transaction and we can see that this also went through successfully so another look we click done and we see that the stake has been withdrawn successfully if we go back to our wallet we should see a significant increase because the stake is now back in our wallet and you see that we received it so as a next step you may uh, wonder how can i now interact uh, with metamask because we are on silica 2 pro domainnet which is evm first so you have you can obviously interact uh, with metamask and that's the next step we look at i prepared here a little metamask wallet which is already connected to my pro domainnet if you're not yet connected to pro domainnet you can just go to chainlist.org and connect to the network the first thing we need to do is we need to find the right wallet representation in the silica format so we copy our evm format address we can go to devx.silica.com we can paste our wallet address search for it and then there is this little converter button here where you can see this is my initial wallet and this is the sil representation which we're gonna copy i then jump back to my silpay wallet i click on silpay uh, sil i paste the converted wallet address and let's say we're sending 1000 sills from my silpay silica address to my metamask evm address all on proto mainnet continue we confirm i sign again on my hardware wallet and we wait for the funds to arrive I will refresh in a couple of seconds and then we should see um, that the funds are right. You always need to make sure that you convert the right wallet um, and the right format. So when you send from SILPAY to MetaMask, you need to convert from the SIL format to the 0xEVM format. And you can also always send it back from the EVM or from MetaMask wallet to the SILPAY wallet. But you then just need to convert the SIL wallet, or the SIL format, to the 0x format. Good. Uh, we can see the 1000 SILs arrived. And that concludes the tutorial. If you have any questions, you can always leave a comment or reach out directly to our social channels. Otherwise, uh, join me in testing and playing with this. And I'm looking forward for the Proto Mainnet uh, launch, which will be soon. Thank you and bye.